Meantime, Philadelphia has declared a heat health emergency as near triple digit temperatures continue to bake the Delaware and Lehigh Valleys this week. Eyewitness News reporter Wakisha Bailey is live at Logan Square to share what that means for residents in the city and how you can beat the heat. Good morning, Wakisha. Good morning, Jim. Yeah, you know, even at this hour, it is pretty warm, a lot warmer than it was yesterday. We're starting to feel the humidity and officials are telling people there are two things they need to do. That's stay cool and hydrate it. Now, because of these extreme weather conditions, the city has issued a heat health emergency from noon until 8 p.m., but it could be extended depending on the severity of the heat. Now, the city has activated several resources to include cooling centers, outreach for people experiencing homelessness, and officials are also sending out a reminder to check on the elderly. Meanwhile, our crews were out asking folks, how are they holding up in the heat? And many of them say they are taking advantage of the cooler periods of the day, like before noon. We're getting a little humidity in the air here, so yeah, yeah we're going to try to do indoorsy things later. Reading Terminal and National Constitution Center. Okay. Yep. Everything indoors. Everything indoors. A lot of people are looking for morning outlets and trying to beat the heat. I am feeling the heat, and I think this really is the best time to do it because later on in the day, you are, it's just too hot to come out here and do any sort of, anything more than, than walking. And you're going to work later on? And I'm going to work. I guess I can't call out sick now. Talk about dedication. That was our colleague Howard Monroe, who's a reporter here at CBS News, and he's with November Project, a workout group. They meet twice a week at 6 a.m., rain or shine. And once again, there are tons of resources that the city has available. And if you have any questions that are related to the heat, you can call that number on the screen below between the hours of noon and 8 p.m., and someone will be there to assist you. Reporting from Logan Square, Wakisha Bailey, CBS 3 Eyewitness. News. Well, Keisha Howard is dedicated. You wouldn't see me out there at 6 a.m. in this temperatures. No, Jim, and you know what? He even rides his bike to work. He rode his bike there. He's just riding all around the city, and he's working out, and he's still going to go to work. I'm I can't telling even you, believe it. Crazy comes in all <laughs> forms. Thank you, Wakisha. Appreciate it. <laughs> stay cool out there. Well, you can stay on top of the dangerous heat. Download the CBS Philly app for free from the App Store or by scanning the QR code that you see right there on your screen.